this off, guys. I'm here to play with a live reaction to JoJo! Episode 21, yo. I did not know this was gonna air. I mean, I posted a comment, like a, you know, comment, and you guys said this episode will air. It's next, like next week's, I can't even talk. Next week episode that will, you know, no! Oh my god, yo, let's jump right into this, guys. It's King Crimson, like, what the heck? I don't know why the boss thought, like, you know? Why, not the boss, but why did Bruno think he can just face the boss? It's good to see that they didn't change the opening as well, because I love this opening, man. I don't want the opening to end. So what I'm getting from, like, after, like, doing a lot of thinking this week, King Crimson. So what they're basically saying is, the boss goes in time, like he goes to the future. Is it me or is Araki, like every stand that we face, like villain is like a time user. Dio, he can go back nine seconds in time. Kira, I think Kira could go back in time like, like an hour or two hours or something like that, or a, I forgot. He could go back in time, like, along those lines. And then, now we have, you know, the main villain here, who, I, it looks like, FIGHTING GOLD! It looks like he goes, like, forward in time. So he's, like, moving to the future. Like a time machine kind of thing going on. Interesting. But, now the question is, how far does he go in the future? Is there, like, a time limit? Obviously, it's not, like, a big time limit. It looks like it's only like a few seconds kind of thing. Maybe even a minute. But even a minute in the future is bad. Fighting gold! Let's go. Bro, yo, how is everyone's gonna react, man? Bro, Bruno's killed, guys! Look at them fighting over candy. And also, it's confirmed, the boss was literally trying to kill Trish. Wow. Talk about a deadbeat dad. I thought he was trying to love her. Oh my gosh. You guys, please, go inside. What? It's gone? It's in Narancha's mouth! It's cause the ability was used! Narancha ate the candy! But since they went forward in time- wait... Look and see? Joyner was gonna give him the water but now he's already drinking it! Look! Look, see? Everything went forward! That's crazy! Look! Wait, what was that on his leg? Dogs? Kittens? That's what cats do, they just walk on your leg? Like, wow, talk about disrespect. Ah, but Kyo, we gotta do this, man! Look! Again! That's when they were talking. So he used it twice. I can't see anything. All I see is circles. Stop showing us this scene, man. He looks cool, though. You know, at the time I was so, like, frustrated, I couldn't mention how cool he looks. What?! <gasps> what the fuck?! <laughs> he made a zipper in his stomach?! Look!
You can't beat him! Shit, yo! That's broken! He's there! He's there! Yo, that's so trash, man! That's broken! Trash like bad, don't get me wrong, it's a strong ability, but what it's like too strong. That can kill anyone. Oh my gosh. He literally saw every single thing we did and moved to us. Don't kill her, please. Please don't do it, man. That means Trish will have an ability like this. We have to leave. We have to escape, yo. Take Trish and go. But you're bleeding out, man. Oh my gosh. Please. I'm trying to think of a way you can counter his ability, but you really can't. He's gonna come out. Uh-huh. Yeah! That's what I was saying, like it's like a short time period. Oh man, Bruno! Please, please, man, please. Look, he's up. Did he see the turtle happening and lap didn't go in? How does that make sense? Wait, it does make sense. Look at that, he knows everything. Hey. Yeah, it does make sense because he could always see the future, so he would dodge that from happening. See? 
That's why he could, he could dodge the turtle. Because all he would do is... Wait, but he zipped his face, didn't he? That was nice, nice escape. Yeah, look at how mad he looks. Yeah, you see that, like the turtle, he could have just used that ability and quick, Jordan, grab them and run. He's coming up. Don't mess with the boss, just leave. No. No. No way. He's dead! No! What? I'm confused, man! Are you dead or alive? Join your please! Anything with all of us here. Yeah, stay over there, King Crimson. Yeah, we would have got him because it's like six people. Oh, oh, he's he's more about his identity. That makes sense though. Bro, this stand looks awesome. Look at, look at that. It looks awesome. Now he's on our ass. We, so you see the thing is, right? Halfway? How? How is it halfway already? Aw, oh, man. Guys, get on the boat. Let's get out of here.
They're like, shit, really? <laughs> you betrayed him? <laughs> Bro, I'm so happy Bruno's alive. Oh my gosh, my heart, man. <sighs> I had a feeling, yo. Like last week, I was like, there, there has, you know? Yeah, explain it, man. Explain it more. What? No, you're not. Are you sure? No, guys, this is bad. We, he's not getting blood. He's like a zombie. Try to fix Bruno real fast. Like, see, make, tell him, like, let, there's something wrong. Look, they're like, you should have just let that happen. Guys, yeah, I know they're going to come. They're loyal! They're gonna come, man! Fugo? Wow! Every guys, really? Wow! Look at that. Guys, please, man, we're together, yo. But you know, they made their decision. We told them they can make their decision. Really? It, it didn't look that way. It looked like you were loyal to Bruno. Get out of here, yo. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> we have faith in him. Naransa. 
But that just shows you the fear of the boss, you know what I mean? Oh, Narancha. Aww. Aww. I like Narancha a lot. But you have to do what you want. Yeah, because if he orders you, then you put your life on the line. Man, there's been a split, yo. Aw, I wish everyone would have came. But it's smart. I like the fact that not everyone came. Think about it. He brings that to his life. It's done! Yo, are you kidding? What the heck, man? They were just talking and stuff. I didn't even know. This is awesome. Touching, man. Fugo, bro, are you kidding me? But you can't even be mad at him. Bro, that was so beautiful, yo. Squalo? Oh, they only have our names right now. Bro, they're on our necks! Yo. Also, one thing that I just want to say quick, like... Honestly, it's good that supposedly next week there's no JoJo episode and that's kind of good because it says right here special program That's kind of good for me because next week I wasn't gonna be able to react to JoJo like because you know my neighbor she was having like, you know a Funeral kind of thing going on and there was gonna be a lot of her family members coming So she wanted it quiet. So from Friday Saturday and Sunday I could not make any videos because I was going to make it quiet. So, good thing there's just going to be a special program. I'll watch that on my own. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So, like, all the reactions for Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, I can't do them, basically. Because of, you know, the funeral going on. But, yo. This episode, man. And, you know, like I said with Fugo. I can't hate. I'm not going to hate. You know, I'm not going to even say anything because it's like... I love the fact that there was one out of the gang that said I can't do this because what we're doing is suicide. 
We're going against the organization. We're going against the boss. We're going against these big shots that they, you know, like they, they kill people. They don't play games. This is a big gang filled with different groups, different capos, all these people following one person. And if he says you're a traitor and he wants your head, you're done. You're done. You're finished. You know what I mean? So you're putting up so much on the line. It's a big risk, so I can't even be upset with Fugo not, you know, joining. But then again, to me, I feel Fugo should have stayed with us because, I mean, he's not labeled a traitor, so he'll be fine. But it's like we've always been together kind of thing. And like I said, I understand he doesn't want to lose his life, you know. Maybe he'll come around. Hopefully, like, at a clutch moment, Fugo will pop up. That's what I'm assuming. Maybe that will happen, or maybe we won't see Fugo again this whole entire part. I hope they don't do that. Please don't do that. That we don't see Fugo again the whole entire part. Oh my gosh, it's so good to see that Bruno is alive. But you see, I'm kind of skeptical, right? And the reason being is, Bruno wasn't pumping blood. That's bad. You're supposed to have blood. And from his wound that Giorno saw, there was no blood coming out of him when his hand came out. That's not good. So I'm thinking Bruno is gonna die and that might be what kills him. I hope that's not what happens. Cause then it's like, I mean, you can't even say it's unexpected because it is expected because we see that he's not, there's no blood generating in his body. How long can you survive like that? You know what I mean? Huh. Yo, please. I want Bruno to die. I don't want Bruno to die, yo. I don't want none of my boys to die, yo. I want us all to live. I want us all to live. Please, Araki, let us all live, yo. Oh, man, th this was a battle and a half just fighting the boss. The boss's ability is broken. We can literally just say that because like the boss, what he does is like, imagine I'm making this video and I just ended the video. But then again, I'm like, when I come back into reality, I'm about to end the video. I didn't even end the video, but I already ended the video and the camcorder is already off. You know what I mean? I mean, that's like a, not like a too complex way of looking at it, but he literally goes into, you know, the future by like five seconds or something like five seconds or was it 10 or something like that right and he sees everything that was going to happen to him prior to that and could dodge it so you see that i think the only way to beat the boss is to have an attack that's unpredictable so just like how you know with bruno when even though the boss was coming for him he was able to zip up because that was his motive his motive wasn't like to attack the boss so you kind of have to like be able to think like your way through you're like all right i'm gonna attack this but it's not really an attack it's actually this and he won't predict it you know what i mean you have to try to outwittle the boss that's basically how you can beat him but yeah the ability is pretty broken and it makes sense why nobody really seen his identity and why like nobody really knows him or anything like that and just the fact that he was trying to take trish out i can't believe him why would you do that yo that's your daughter he doesn't want no one to see him man like that's so messed up Ah, oh, Trish. I really like Trish too. I'm so happy that she didn't die. I can't wait for her to wake up so we can see her reaction. I wonder if the gang's gonna tell her. No, but then again, Bruno did mention when Trish wakes up, he was gonna say something like, that wasn't your father or something, or your father wasn't, you know, he wasn't found. Something along those lines. But then again, I feel like the truth has to come out that your father's gonna kill you. And you know, thinking about Trish's stand ability, she has something to an extent like the bosses. Oh my gosh, that's kind of cool! Don't you think like going like to the future by like five seconds, like that's, that's kind of awesome! And seeing that Rocky, every person, you know, like a villain has like a time power to an extent, it's smart. Because you see, I can see what he's trying to do if that's his point. If his point is time, like if you can control time, you can beat anyone. Because that is true. If I have time in my hands, I can kill anyone. Like look at Dio stand. Stops time for nine seconds. In nine seconds, I could cut your throat. All right, this is getting kind of dark. <laughs> I can cut your throat. What am I saying? <laughs> this is kind of getting dark. But like, look at Kira Stan. Like, I, I don't remember Kira Stan that much. I think he, like, he can go back in time like, like a lot, right? Like an hour or something, or like 30 minutes, was it? Like something like that? Paito doso! Something, you know, I, I forgot it. I really forgot it, but yeah, I knew it was time related. But. If it is that he can go back like an hour or so, he can kill you before you ever get to him. You know what I mean? And look at this ability now. Going forward and you can see the attacks and dodge it. 
Like, time is crazy. I wonder if the next villain for part 6 has a time-related ability. Do all the villains have a time-related ability? How much can you do with time? You already went back, you already stopped time for a few seconds, and now you're going forward. What else can you do, I wonder? Hmm, pretty awesome. Pretty awesome, yo. But, you know, that sums up everything. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Like, honestly, thank you so much for all of you who watch JoJo with me. Like, it's really, and it, like, I, man, I love JoJo. I love watching every episode. Like, David Production is always doing an amazing job. They make, they please the fans, yo. I'm stuttering right now, I can't even talk properly. But you know, they know how to please the fans, how to, you know, tickle our fancy, and just make these enjoyable episodes. Like, this is... <laughs> Bro, I thought Bruno died like twice this episode. When he got cut over there, and then when he was up there. I thought he died. Bro, don't play with my emotions like that, yo. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much for watching, guys. If you made it to the end, you're amazing, yo. Peace!